right now. I want to welcome to the program one of my uh, favorite players in the NFL, Mr. Matt Light of the New England Patriots. Matt, how you doing, sir? Cam, I'm good. Good to be talking with you. Hey, it's great to have you back here. It's hard to believe that it is already that time of year again, but you guys are getting ready for the seventh annual celebrity shootout for the uh, Matt Light or the Light Foundation uh, coming up in Mapleville, Rhode Island. We are, yeah. It is hard to believe it's been a year, but uh, you know, I say a lot's happened in a year. We've uh, added a lot to our own foundation and the work that we do with kids from across the country, and you know, we've had a lot of support from a lot of people, and you know, really. It all comes from this one event. I mean, this is our big fundraiser for the year. And and let's talk a little bit about what the Light Foundation does, because I think it's such a good program, and it benefits so many kids. Uh, uh, first of all, how'd you get the idea, and, and what does the Light Foundation do? Well, you know, I think the idea just came from when I got to New England, it was very apparent from day one that the Kraft family and the Patriots uh, charitable organization, you know, they really go out of their way to make an impact. and. You know, I guess when I saw that, I decided to want to, you know, I want to do something on my own. So came up with the idea to do, you know, just a lot of work with kids and get them in the outdoors. And, you know, we created this facility in Ohio, and it's just, it's been incredible. It's been a lot of fun, too. Well, you know, that's one of the cool things about the event, um, the, the fact that this is a, a sporting clays tournament. Uh, and, and you bring in, I mean, I was up there last year, and I got to tell you, I, I was impressed by the star power that was assembled uh, for this uh, this sporting clays tournament, Matt. You know, it's usually a little bit difficult to get guys to give up, you know, their one-off day a week. But when you throw in guns, <laughs> for some reason, you know, it just it makes my job a lot easier. And I'll tell you, um, the guys on this team, they support the foundation so much. I mean, these guys have come year in, year out. And, you know, we're going into our seventh year, and, you know, we've uh, we've asked these guys to come out and help us year after year, and they always do it. They always show up, but as well as the other local celebrities. And, you know, we got Adam Roach coming in, uh, you know, pro baseball player and, you know, just a great guy. We've got uh, guys like Lenny Clark that help us MC the event. And, uh, you know, it's just a lot of fun. It's just really nice to have those guys supporting us. No, absolutely right. Uh, and like I said, I mean, it's a, it's a fantastic event. The Sporting Clays Tournament, you've got the uh, auction going on. You've got, uh, I mean, really, it's just, it's a whole day. I mean, it's not a matter of going out for a few hours. Plan on spending the whole day there at uh, Addyville Farms, which is just a beautiful location. Uh, now, this is coming up September the 20th. Are, are there still slots available? You know, we have, uh, I believe, two more foursomes still available. We also sell dinner tickets. So if you want to come for the, the, the latter portion of the event, uh, we have four outstanding comedians uh, headlined by Tony V and you know, they're going to be great. Uh, they're going to get up there and, you know, I'm sure have a have a few good jokes to share with us. And, you know, beforehand, like you're saying, it is a whole day event. Beforehand, you know, our gun sponsors, you know, Ruger and Six Hour and Remington, these guys have been with us for so long. Um, they do a great job of setting up all kind of games with uh, plate rack targets and resettable targets all donated from MGM. And, you know, it's just been great. I mean, it's going to be a really – fun day from the very beginning to the very end and you know a lot of shooting at, but at the end of the day you saw the auction you know those people they come and they know that they're going to you know really help out the auction and really help us raise a lot of money it's been incredible it really has yeah it, it's absolutely fantastic now I, while we've got you here matt i've got to ask you you know about the football season which kicks off for the uh, patriots on monday night at miami uh any thoughts going into this season yeah, you know, I'm just glad, number one, that we got it in, that we got everything solved, and we got back to work, and, you know, ultimately guys got back to doing what they love to do. And I'll tell you, it's been a it's been a good camp. It's been a different camp, obviously. Uh, we have some rule changes and things of that nature, but um, really got a lot of good work in. We got, you know, young guys that are really helping us out, and, you know, we got good depth in certain areas and a lot of competition. So I'm, I'm excited about this year. You know, I, I want to ask you something, Matt. Uh, there, there's been some talk of players uh, who have games on Sunday uh, commemorating the 10th anniversary of 9-11, whether it's, you know, uh, via something that they're wearing, a uh, headband, you know, a wristband, something like that. Uh, I understand that the NFL has kind of cracked down, but they've also, it seems to me, uh, done done something good. I know that the, the league wants conformity in terms of the uniforms, but they have said that players can wear red, white, and blue on 9-11. What, what's your take on uh, players expressing, you know, solidarity and, and some solemnity uh, on the anniversary of 9-11, and, and what do you think of the NFL's take? Well, I'll tell you, you know, we've done a lot over the years, um, 
you know, through different uh, events, charity events, fundraisers, things to help raise money, you know, for the many of the people that, that were affected, you know, by 9-11. I think the league's done a good job uh, of recognizing, you know, and, and, and obviously remembering, you know, those affected. And, and you know, as players, um, you know, each guy uh, has his own way of going about that. And, you know, certain guys are affected more than others. You know, I can think back to my rookie year and, you know, obviously everybody remembers where they were and what they were doing at the time. But, you know, I was playing with a guy that played right next to me. He was our left guard, Joe Andruzzi. You know, just an incredible guy all around. I mean, he, he fought back from cancer. Um, he's now working with kids, you know, with, through his foundation. And his brothers, all three of them, you know, were uh, firefighters in New York. And they were all affected by that. They were all there, you know, in the towers. And they all survived. But, you know, you, you, your heart goes out to those people that were affected by it. And, you know, we all, I think we all celebrate it. Or not celebrate it, but, you know, obviously uh, remember mm-hmm. that day uh, in, in our own way. Absolutely. Well, listen, Matt, again, it's a real pleasure to uh, have you on the program. If folks want more information about this uh, celebrity shootout that's coming up on September the 20th, can they get it at the uh, website for the Light Foundation? Yeah, you know, if they just go to mountlightfoundation.org, uh, we have all the information there on the on the main homepage. And, you know, if uh, if you can't make it out to the event, you can always check out what we do and, and how we do it. And, you know, we, uh, we just really appreciate Cam, you know, helping us out with this event. And, you know, we just look forward to getting more and more kids into the outdoors and, you know, along that route versus others down down the road. Absolutely. Listen, I, I can't thank you enough for what you're doing uh, both as a New England Patriots fan Uh, And as a human being, what you're doing with kids, getting them into the great outdoors. Matt, it's always a pleasure, sir. Hopefully we can uh, do this again soon. And good luck to you, sir, with the uh, Celebrity Shootout this year. I appreciate it, boss. Thank you, sir. Matt Light joining us from the New England Patriots.